Uh, my electrical listeners of the gaming community, I do so hope that you're having the finest of evenings and are ready to kick back, relax, and hit your friends in the kneecaps to watching some tiny buns. Welcome one and welcome all to another episode of the Stardew Valiants. I am Ian Kelly from The Still Winter, and if you enjoy the music at the beginning of the episode or at the end, please check out thestillwinter.org. We are going to continue on. I believe this is our tre dos plus un episode of our Stardew Valley journey. Epic, epic journey. That was an alien in his undies. Very exciting. So we're going to load it up and we're going to see where we are on this wonderful trip that we have made possible. I am going to collect an item. Which I have just done. Ah! <laughs> Wasn't that exciting? So we are the top one. We have made it to the eighth of spring. And that's what we're gonna do. Yes, I've changed clothing multiple of times throughout this uh, this uh, two and a half episode series so far. <laughs> so we're gonna start watching the TV, the tele. See where we go. Let's check the uh, fortune teller. Oh, I sense that a new viewer has joined us. Young man from Stardew Valley, welcome. Spirits are very happy today. They'll do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Thank goodness it's not a bath. Think about if you had to take a bath with good fortune. Oh, a bathe. We, we wish to bathe everyone in good fortune. It is raining outside, so we are pleased. We don't have to water those dirty plants. We got some beans growing on the side here with one patch of grass. This is where we uh, play in the mud. We invite all of our friends over. Please, please come in, check it out. Uh, usually once a day, we chop down one tree a day now. We've changed it up from chopping down five trees a day to one tree a day because during these days, we now like to go cutting things with our sword of power. We have opened up the boulders and now we are Champions, saviors of the area. Saviors, I say. Oh, no, we can't put that there. So we have labeled each one of these boxes, if I have not shown anyone. See, that one is named the gathering box, the crafting box, the tools box, and the mining box. So we're going to put copper bars inside of that. We have not opened up our sprinkler system yet. So instead... Today, we are going to go into the mine and we are going to do some adventuring. We are going to cut down the foes with our fearless blade of devastating destruction. If you guys see any worms, make sure we find the worms so we can cut them down. Oh, is that worms? It looks like worms. Ha! Ah, it's not worms. They have to be wiggling, so they look like worms, but... They have to wiggle, caniggle. <gasps> berries, berries, that's not berries. There was no berries in there to begin with. So we opened up these boulders that were sitting right here. That guy that was just sitting there going, pick, 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 pick. He decided that he picked enough times and the boulder fell apart. So we went inside of here and then we met Marlin, the old man, who said, could you please kill some slimes for me and reach the lowest part? So we did some mining. And we have reached down to level 20. We are champions. Right here is where you can do some fishing. Probably not catch very much, except the common cold. And now we're gonna slam! Slam! We are killers! Killers of the slime! And whatever that white thing is. So... Oh no, it's turned into the fly! If you don't kill those white things fast enough, then they turn into the fly, and the fly is very angry. Um, I'm not really sure <laughs> about what's going on in here. Is there is there something that like I'm missing? <laughs> is there like a brightness setting we're not seeing here? Because there's nothing to pick. Are you seeing anything? There's nothing to pick here. Okay, let's try this again. Let's 
let's let's go back down. We had to go to 20 and then 21 because there was nothing to do that. So a retake at what we just did. Take that, have at thee. I know you guys are probably pretty impressed by the way he swings a sword right now because yeah, that's that's impressive. That's pretty hardcore actually. Okay, we are still not seeing any form of ladder. Okay. Oh, that's not the good. Okay. So we got flies, we got larvae. Come on. Ah, he's become Metal Man of Destruction. Come on. So we've taken him down, and it looks like he, this time they have left a passageway into the nether. Oh, that's wrong. Wrong game. <laughs> Let's go check out what they've left for us inside of their little wooden barrels. Chop, chop. So you chop these lovely rocks and some of them drop you minerals. Other one drops you geodes. Some of them drop nothing and other ones drop carrots. These carrots are good for, uh, let's find out. What are they good for? Uh, they're good for letting you see things. So it's, it's very good we ate one. They help on your vision. There's also carrots that help on your dental. <laughs> Apparently you need that in Stardew Valley. You need to have shiny good teeth. Oh, oh, he got it. Okay, now we're gonna get some coppers. Oh, we got one bomb. Let's get rid of some of this fiber. Why do we keep fiber and proteins inside of our pockets? Nobody knows. But we got some more copper, and that's all that matters. Can't catch me, copper! Ah, 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 ah. I thought that was funny. You know, like it took the place of a, uh, whatever. <laughs> Apparently, Miss Destroyer does not find that hilarious. What am I doing? She's busy petting a cat. If you guys haven't noticed, she's pretty much doing that most of the time. I'm busy! To notice what you're doing because I'm doing something real. Petting a cat. Chop, chop. Oh, we want that. We want that thing. It's like a geode, but not a geode. Right there. Okay. Oh, that was the perfect one. Are we going to be able to do it on our very first shot here? Nope. Get the slime! Marlon wants to kill slimes. We want to be accepted into his club. His club of awesome badasses. Two-dimensional badasses. Two-dimensional electric badasses. Yes. Looks like we are gonna make it. Okay, nothing, nothing. Oh, what is that? I don't know what this is, but we're gonna we're about to find out. Ah, oh, Aquamarine, we need that to impress the ladies. And we're gonna have it. And we're gonna impress them ladies. But Miss Destroyer's not depressed. Oh. <laughs> She's not impressed, that's what I meant. Okay. Down this wonderful path. I'm pretty sure my clothing makes me look like an archaeologist. I think it fits well. Oh yeah, that works well. Maybe it's just the brown. Everyone who's adventuring should be wearing brown. There's some serious dark spots inside of this place. Sheesh. Oh, we cut all that fiber in one swipe of our mighty sword. Oh, we're gonna get that. Get it, get it. We have almost made it to level 30. 
We really need to expand our inventory. We're not getting much anywhere. Oh, he poisoned me. He gave me H-I. What's the last letter? H-I. He gave me a high. <laughs> that fool made me high. I would have taken this room, but I ain't got no room. Oh, that's a sweet nursery rhyme. You could take the shroom, but you ain't got no room. You ain't got no room. You ain't got no Why'd room. Why you take the watering can and the hoe? Why do you ask these weird questions? Oh, we've made it. That's six spaces taken up by tools. When really you just need two of those. I think we should call this... Oh, the boogeyman's after us. I think we should call this one... At level 30, and then let's see if this guy opens up his doors. Oh, he has. Do I need a new sword? No, I need to. I re need to read this. I've killed 13 slimes, zero questionables, zero questionables, zero questionables, and some insects and duggies. What's a duggy? Dance. Dig, diglet, dig, diglet, dig, diglet, dig, diglet. I think that's Look funny. You. Look at behind me. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, how it's, bad he looks. It's Tundra. It's chunky. He does look chunky. Look at him. I've never seen him before. Okay, we don't want any of that crap. Marlin, we don't want your garbage. Oh, look at Gil. He looks so happy. Come here, Gwen. You got something to show me, kid. Cash can be dangerous. Make sure you're prepared. Oh, he's got a book back here. You smell funny. You smell funny. <laughs> so we are level one inside of luck, level one inside of combat, level two in foraging, and whatever that other Fishing. level two is. We're level zero in fishing. Yeah, a warm rain is a pleasant way to get clean. That guy lives on the edge. He knows what he's death. living for, of death. <laughs> lives on the edge of death. It doesn't look like he's gonna you be. You missed Gus's birthday. Gus's? It was on the 7th. Mayor Lewis? Yeah. I actually gave him a gift on his birthday. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I don't see your friend thing. Okay, well, I don't know if it's raised any, but I gave him a gift. No, you didn't. Yes, I Not did. Not one that he liked. I gave him one that he thought was okay. I gave him like a, a daffodil. Worms. Worms! Ha! Today we've received a book. A lost book. But now it's been found. So why doesn't it say found book? You have found a book that was once lost and now it is found. Let's visit our lady. See what she's up to. Oh, she ain't even home yet. Making her parents worry about her kids these days, huh? Probably slutting around and freaking with Sam. <laughs> slutting around with Sam and Shane. I'll wait for her in front of her front doors. I need can't to know. Can you track where they are on the map? Oh yeah, I can, can't I? She is over, the, wait, no, that's Jazz, okay. Where the crap is she? I am not seeing her. She's in the saloon. Not in the saloon. Yeah, she is. Oh, she's right. She may be in the saloon. You in here getting drunk? <laughs> Slutting out here, have a gift. I have this! You're the best grief! Oh, you better love me now. Who's this up here? Oh, Shane was not happy watching me give her a gift. He was like, Thirsty. Playing the I am not playing in that again. 
Read that thing in the interstate library. Oh, Clint was not happy that I gave something to her. And Willie? Willie is not happy. Who are these guys? Who are you? Never mind, we're in Calico Desert. It's where my friend Sandy lives. Yeah, I'm good not speaking to her. And what about you? Leia. Trees look nice today, don't they? That's how Leia sounds. Why did I become a farmer? It's more real than living in the city. To follow grandpa's bootsteps. To live in bootstraps, bootstraps. I want to escape my old life. Is it? It's the same reason you came here, Leia? You just earned a heart. Hey, did I? I didn't. Nobody has hearts. Nobody likes me yet. I've been here for eight days and nobody is even warmed up to saying hi to me. I'm gonna bring famine and pestilence to this town. Okay, we got uh, we got just enough energy to grab this daffodil, that one, and sell them on the black market. We're gonna sell them here. Oh yeah, 60 bucks. Oh yeah, we're definitely keeping keeping some ores. We're gonna need all that copper. The geodes, the stones, the omni geodes. Let's chop some trees! 9.30 at night, we are out there in the wolf infested den. Chopping the trees, not just any trees, the birch trees. Yes, if you point at Tunji, <laughs> he will become more of a cat. Get on that log. I'm becoming more of a cat too. Chop, chop! Oh man. A long drive today. I drove an hour and a half somewhere, sat down for about 45 minutes, drove an hour and a half back. Now I have a headache. And that's why I'm here playing games. So I could take this ax and whack other things of how I feel my headache should be dealt with. Do you want some co coffee? Yes, I would love a cup of coffee. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Danke schön. Donker Shane! I can't even see what's going on now. This should be the last of our energy and we are ready for some bedtime. Okay, let's get some sleep. The night is young. And we end the day learning how to live off the land. Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Let's talk some fences. Fences are useful for keeping weeds at bay and protecting your crops. As a land farmer contained your livestock, fences break down after a while, but stone, iron, and hardwood fences last a lot longer than the basic wood. Kazoo 5 is always giving us sweet sunny days, in which they've done again. We are going to sleep for the night. We've leveled up in some mining, got ourselves a staircase. Come on. And that's all we have done for today. Thank you so much for watching and please like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe to this music gaming channel as we have a ton more music videos and awesome forms of entertainment for your viewing and listening body parts. Please check out www.thestillwinter.org if you enjoy any of the music at the beginning or the end of the video, as well as sometimes randomly inside of the middle. Please check it out. Still Winter, Ian, out. Baby, without you I've gone crazy.